Nothing like going down the old street, you know? I'm about to take you on a little tour of my old home neighborhood here, down Park Road. We'll be passing a few exciting spots, and uh, I'll tell you a little bit about it as we go. Here on the right, we have the Parkin residence, where George and I became friends and then learned how to fight each other. And of course, I knew his older sisters at certain times where we were discovering each other's development and bodies. And this middle house, I don't remember, but this is the Omens, Janet and Walter Omen, 37. There right, I'm said. filming down this way. Okay, now we have Mr. Caldwell. Mr. Caldwell, uh, I remember... It's Calvin. Calvin, yeah, he was... Uh, Walt Calvin was in our Had some place. brief difficulties in our restroom, didn't he? <laughs> okay, and there's uh, Gary Schubert over there to the left. I can't get that. <laughs> do you want to tell the story? Oh, I can if you just slow down. Give what? Time <laughs> to get to Gary Schubert. Oh, do you want me to... Uh, Go backwards. Yeah. Okay. We're backing up here. Did, did that bit about Mr. Calvin through yeah. you? Caldwell? It's Calvin. <laughs> Yeah, he did have difficulty. Didn't I know he did. Chats was to tell those stories. All right, we'll just make it. All right, nice. here we go. This is Gary Schubert. Nice house. story. Now, Gary Schubert was always the uh, the power hungry maniac in the neighborhood. He used to poison our goldfish and beat up on us. But later, we realized he had a pool that we never went into. And uh, one time, I I did say hello to him, but he and my older brother Craig sort of got into it many times, creating harmony on the block, of course. But quite a nice house there, right in, in front of the uh, Mr. Capel. Who That's right. Is, uh, I Let's think do Capel's house. Let's try to get in the driveway. Mr. Capel's like 105 years old That's now. Right. Actually still alive at this shooting, which is amazing. We're going to take a left and go in and see if we can set off some alarms up in the <laughs> driveway here. Um, they do have 78 Park Road here. They have an extensive swamp down here that's sort of part of the same... Let me see if I shoot this out the window like this. Still part of the. No, you can get. You can get this is Kappel's, better. Uh, 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 I got it. Go. I got it. Mailbox? Yes, it's already. It's gone. Very go good. for it. All right, mailbox and the tube there. Yes, I got that. All right, now we're passing in here to the, to the very nice grounds, uh, little seats and bridges. And brick I think we shouldn't spend too much time here. Let's just go. Now, through. Mr. Capel, of course, well, he's not here, I believe. But he, of course, is the grandfather of the girl that Craig first married, Carolyn Groves. And I didn't know that. Carolyn Groves, of course, uh, has now remarried and has adopted uh, with her new husband and daughter, Connie. Uh, but they lived up on the back lot of Mr. Uh, Chapel, Chapel. Now we're approaching Park Road again, getting back out on the road. This is where, uh, actually, Tom, uh, an extension of his paper route here. That's right. Delivering many journal heralds, I think. Yeah, Dave Daly. Dave Daly. Stop. We almost had an accident on film. Almost an accident. <laughs> Jeez, on don't she look? She, oh, she's she's she lives in our old house. Look, she'll be great. Here. Yeah, great. We, that would have been fun. Okay. As we avoided Let's the go up there and talk to her. Should Hold it, sir. Sure, we'll video. Sure, we'll video. Huh? Tell her you used to live here. You did you used to live here. Yeah, she'll like that. Pull in. We're gonna pull into Park Road here and just apologize. Say honk. Yeah. Give a honk. Yeah, go ahead. I'll just say it real quick. Yeah. I want to apologize for almost hitting you there. I, I didn't know your name. My name's Shriver. I used to live here about 20 years ago. Well, I'm happy to meet you. Yeah, my name's, I'm glad we didn't crash. <laughs> right. But it's Which really, Shriver are you? I'm the youngest, Alan. Alan. Well, yeah. I'm Gracie Weisbroden. Nice to meet you. Weisbroden. I, yeah, I don't house. know the name. Like, the house is great. Good, good. Probably looks, is different. Oh, it's really nice, though. You really kept it up good. Oh, well, it's going to get painted, so it'll feel oh, a little again. better. Well, that's always fun to paint it. Yeah. Huh? Uh -huh. Yeah. We used to have a little basketball court up there at one time. Oh, did you? Uh oh, yeah. we don't have boys. Oh, oh. So well, you probably. Yeah, my husband would have liked it had you saved it, had you All left right. it up there, though. Well, that's well. nice to see. This is where I first practiced in a Volkswagen up and down this, oh, <laughs> this driveway many times, back and forth. You know. Golly, that's yeah. great. I'm just visiting my folks. They they moved back here, and uh, I'm just visiting them from California. I'm going back next week. Oh, I see. It's kind of great. fun. Tom, Tom's a friend of mine from high school. We're just getting oh, together. well, I'm glad to meet you. My uh, roommate in college was Chipper Ludwig. Did, did Chipper you? Ludwig? Yeah. Oh, she <laughs> dated, she dated <laughs> Eric. Right. That's right, Eric. Yeah. She was the cheerleader uh -huh. that, oh, yeah. Well, she, um, 
she lives in Oregon now. Oh. And she came back for the 20th reunion, I guess, in two couple years ago. Oh, she <laughs> did. I've been here taping you. That's great. Hey, that's really neat. Anyway, she called me. She shipper. said, you don't live at 111 Park Road. It's incredible because I'm from Texas, and here I am living in this house here in Oakwood, and she grew up here, and she's gone. But no, wait, you're, you're just friends of hers, though. You weren't in the high school with Chipper? No, I went to college with her roommate. Oh, oh I mm -hmm. see. Okay, I got it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Of course, Erica... I had this Where's room your bedroom? Here. This one yeah, I had this room up here where the, the bathroom's in the middle, and Eric was on the far side. Okay. They split us up when we began fighting. <laughs> <laughs> well, that, that, you know, the bedrooms that were there, those two? Yeah, that was my two older brothers. They okay, were always well, in trouble. that's one room now. It's a playroom. Oh. We took the wall out. Oh, for both rooms on that side, before you went down the steps over the yep. garage? Oh, that's yep. great. Yeah. Yeah, they never did have quite enough room for each other. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Those are my oldest, my oldest brothers. Yeah. Oh, that is great. That's well, oh, uh, no. I, I I just thought of something. I don't I don't have it with me. Um, my dad. Uh, this is about ten years ago. They were throwing a lot of stuff out before they were thinking about moving. And one day I'm going by their place in Laguna Beach in California, and he's got this old binder. I mean, it's probably 1920 something like that leather. He's dropping it in the trash. I said, "What's that?" Because I do that with him. In case he's doing that all the time, you know. And it turns out it's it's some of the original construction shots on this house. And the next time I come to Dayton, I'll bring it and I'll oh, give it to you. would you? Yeah. I would love it. I mean, it. It's, it's when they're dropping the rock into the pond out oh, there. Oh, for Pete's the, sake. The first original yes. rock, you know. Yeah. When was this house built? Oh, this was 19, is either 1917 or 1927. I'm not oh, sure wow. which. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, it's somewhere, somewhere in that it's range. Really... Oh, please, would you? And I'll tell you, I'm on my way to get my daughter for a tennis lesson. But would you stop in and visit us the next time? Well, I will. Or if, before yeah. you leave, you want to stop by and um, take I, a look at the be, inside? It would be fun. Yeah. <laughs> it would be fun. I think what I, what I'll do, just so, just so you can. Uh, Actually, if you see Chipper, you can prove to her that I came by. Oh, yes. But that's my address in California. Okay, terrific. And I, I, I don't need a reminder. I'll just, the next time I come, I'll, I'll do it. But, you know, at least you'll have that. that and as I said, if you have a minute before you leave, you want to stop in, please feel free. I would, I would like well, to. Nice. Would you do me a favor and just, I, I'd like to give you a little a little phone before I do, you know, give you a warning if I was going to come by. Sure. I'm, gonna, I'm going down to Cincinnati for a few days, but I'll be back Sunday. Okay. So yeah. let me just give you a call on right. Sunday. What's what's your, I'm sorry, I don't remember it's your Weisbrot. name. It's Weisbrot. W-E-I-S-B-R-O-D. W-E-I-S. B-R-O-D. You gave us the weirdest look back there, you know? Well, you almost ran into him. God, I almost <laughs> had a heart attack. <laughs> I was excuse me? I wasn't paying much attention and whipped you. Well, I used to speed down this road, too. <laughs> Let's see, W-E-I-S. B-R-O-D. B-R-O-D. What's your first name? Tonight, uh, Gracie. Gracie, okay. Mm -hmm. That's not like Gracie and George Allen, though. No, but they spelled okay. it right. Okay. My God. Did, okay, uh -huh. Gracie. 298 Okay, great. How many daughters great. do you have? Just the one. Okay, great. Sort of, All right. Yeah. Well, we'll see you again. Yeah, she got one kid in this big I house. Know. Isn't that amazing? Gee, we I got a lot. Isn't that right? <laughs> That's not bad. No. Not bad. Well, at least you know. You know where they this house they built back here used to be a huge leaf pile. That's kind of that's different. People, um, well, when you see when you come in, you'll see. We're used to it because it was never any different. But people who don't know go, oh, oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I almost sold that lot off on the side when we built when we bought the house. That lot was separately for sale. That would have taken care of the pond and the garden and everything. Oh yeah. And yeah. so we said, no, we think we want to do. When when the, you know when Dad had when he was when they were working on selling this in the '60s, they. Uh, he, he hired an architect to subdivide the lots as an option for what they were going to do. And then when the, when the people bought it, they just carried the plans with them. So he should have probably destroyed the plans. Yeah, know? because it <laughs> really yeah. Good. It's not too bad, though. Hey, nice seeing you. It's nice seeing you, too. All right. Okay, we'll nice see meeting you. you. Okay, right. bye-bye. Lots of, lots of good karma in that house. <laughs> <laughs> Adolescent years. How about the timing on this thing, huh? That was great. <laughs> Alan, I told you to be spontaneous. Yeah. I'm glad you suggested driving in there. Chipper Ludwig's roommate friend in school. She's beautiful, isn't she? Oh, what a mouth. Oh, Should we discuss beautiful. her mouth on film? Uh, no, let's not, because someone might see it. Someone might see it. I'm going to turn it exciting. off now. Is that enough? I think, well, well, we do have this over here. Um, I well, think don't stop in the road. No, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. Go ahead. I'm go still ahead. filming. Are you still filming? Yeah. Okay, yeah, I want to comment on this. This is Which, Bob, Bob Coons's sledding hill. All right. Where Which way? Craig lost part of his finger, and where all of us had many close collisions with these where trees. Where is it? Up here now. It's blocked off by that fence. Oh. We used to come down it's all the way here? up there and end up all down right. here into the trees with our fingers smashed into the trees. Okay. And then this is, of course, Bob Coons' back lot. We're going to pull a Yui here. All right. 
How do you like the steering oh, on this car? Pretty. Oh, I'm just thinking about. I know. This is so nice, so nice. Okay. I'm gonna turn it off. Are you done? Uh, well. Well, no, let's, let's no. I just want right. to do a couple more because this is this will be out there. See, it just pan up. Now, also up on this hill is right, where Bob there. Coons first showed me the ins and outs of croquet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, pardon me. We, this, this is the horde here. This inside oh, inside. Yes. Oh, that's wild. Oh, man, we'll do this a lot of time. But the croquet game with Bob Coons, we had our first training over here. I see this black dot again. Oh, no, that's all right. No. But anyway, the, the croquet occurred up on this front of the house. And then a few years later, when he figured we were advanced enough, he took us back up on the old sledding hill for the advanced croquet course. You did and, lead a wild youth. And we used to hit balls way, way, way <laughs> off. We'd say, we're going to slam your ball into infinity or something. Okay. But then, of course, right beyond this little row of bush across the park road here is the Superman Rock and Goldfish Pond, which Gary Schubert used to poison the goldfish in. Oh, wait, know. we've got something on the window here. I can't see through so that. it's a pellet. Okay, well. Yeah. Oh, but anyway. Should and of course, you know, how, how about take a pan of the back side of the house there? Okay, I got it. Yeah. All right, now turn and I'll get it as we go away from yeah, it. Okay. Now, yeah, because down, down the other edge here is just the monastery right. where the nuns used to walk by to catch the bus. Okay. Really? Okay. I've got this thing here. Yeah, I think I've got a pretty good I'm getting it anyway. <laughs> okay, there we have the uh, sundial and, of course, our mailbox here. We can catch the mail. It's sort of in a, a pale. I like that color. It's kind of nice auburn, sort of greeny green. Robert Coons is. All right, here we have uh, the red door there for jolly frivolity. Okay. Of course, you remember the bus that used to be parked here. Remember yes, the I bus? remember the bus, the infamous bus. And of course, the old Hills and Dales Park where I um, went Boy Scout exploring and okay. walking with Becky McLaughlin. Remember Becky McLaughlin? Yes. Yeah. Big tits. <laughs> well, she was certainly a well developed young girl. Now going back up Park Road, uh, we're viewing some of the... Let me shoot the road itself. Yeah, it's good. It's good to do this. I used to have dreams that I was flying up this road. Really? Yeah, about four, eight, ten feet off the ground. I had a lot of dreams like that. Oh, this has certainly been exciting. Well, I'll tell you, let's go up to this light and turn off the video and then we can uh, relax. I have to take a break. That was Are you ready? certainly exhausting. We're back to having an encounter there. I have to. I know it. Giving her our phone number. Far can... Hills Avenue and Park. Oh wait, pull up a little bit more to get the sign. Oh, here we are. Far Keep Hills, going. You haven't got Far Hills Avenue, Park, and Aberdeen. 